very good evening to you. Welcome back if you've been with us on The Full View. Welcome if you've just tuned in. I'm Francis Hurd. And of course, uh, the big... Uh, big breaking news and and just the huge story today is the constitutional court the highest court in the land uh, sentencing former president jacob zuma to 15 months behind bars uh, there is no more legal recourse here this is the apex court and he is expected to hand himself over uh, within the next five days we'll speak to mac maharaj his one-time spokesperson who was later critical of the former president and we'll speak to the south african communist party as well bringing you all the reaction also looking at the violence reported in Eswatini. These are the top stories. The Not President only has Mr. Zuma failed to dispute the contempt of court, he has also failed to contest the degree of the contempt. The former president, Zuma, has five days to hand himself over to start that 15-month jail term handed down by the Constitutional Court earlier today. They are not going to take him uh, to prison when I'm still alive. They will have to kill me first. I insist on that. Edward Zuma, his son, reacts to the landmark constitutional court a ruling sentencing his father uh, to those 15 months. Springbok, uh, Springbok coach Jacques Nienaba uh, names three debutants for his final test in charge of the world champions against Georgia on Friday. All right, and we'd uh, continue, uh, we continue to take your responses. We'd appreciate them. Hashtag full view. Engage with us on our question of the day. What are your thoughts on former President Jacob Zuma being sentenced for contempt of court?